Our very own Lisa Byington got a head start on the hockey season. On July 18th, Lisa participated in the first ever women's hockey clinic at Mun Ice Arena. Open to all women, participants got the opportunity to learn hockey from some of the very best in the sport. Hi, Lisa Byington with the Big Ten Network. Hey. It's like Halloween. Yeah. I put a meat in here if you want to see it. Oh, okay. There's a small. You get like shoulder pads. Yeah, yeah. that's cool. Okay. Just look, look forward and I'll mark this for you. Perfect. Ready? Let's go. Our real objective here is to introduce you to the game if you haven't been introduced behind the scenes. What made you decide to do this? Well, we're trying to connect with fans, and certainly our sport seems to resonate with female fans at all the different levels. You got your women's coaches to take part in this. You know, they're all real busy this time. You know, there's camps going on, they have recruits on campus, so I, I'm really appreciative of them taking time because if they didn't, I probably wouldn't have felt comfortable enough moving forward and trying. I'm really curious to see the time we spend in the dressing room getting dressed. We left 40 minutes for that. I hope that's enough time. <laughs> yeah, that's right. Yeah, those are, those are going to hold your uh, hockey you socks really up. You really put these on? Yeah. Really? Yes, Sorry. <laughs> These are the socks go over the shin pads. There's more. There is more. Yeah. <laughs> Almost halfway though. <laughs> yeah, get and, and, yep. and, uh, and you may have to help This is service, guys. I appreciate that. For sure. I'm ready anytime. <laughs> get the back. Oh. Whew. That is a lot of work. <laughs> Susie Merchant, how are we doing? Um, this is very challenging. This is in basketball, it's a little less complicated. Have you skated in your life? I'm not sure what I do is considered skating, but it, it resembles skating. Was there any hesitation on your part? Absolutely. I'm probably going to roll an ACL. I'm going to do something. Gosh, no. You know, I mean, that's part of that skate was when I was eight years old in a pond. All right, here we go. First steps. Woo! Woo! How am I doing? How do I stop? How about that? I need to learn how to stop. So when you stop, you're gonna get some speed. You might not want to stand there. <laughs> that was good. This I was nervous. I've never had hockey skates on in my life. In your life? Yeah, in my life. Can you do well, a little I, demo yeah. for us? Oh, yeah. You look like you've skated before. Yes. Many times. You play hockey? Uh, I never really played hockey, but I grew up figure skating, and our high school had a rink in our backyard for a while. I know Stacy can really go out there, so uh, she might be the most skilled of all. I'm expecting Jackie Joseph to have some physicality to her game. You know, Susie Merchant, I was thinking she'd be kind of a skilled player, but, you know, she's talking a lot of trash, so she plays with a lot of energy. Can you edit that? What's your uh, new appreciation for hockey players? Oh, tremendous. I don't know if it's measurable. I mean, first of all, it takes, like, forever to get your gear on. And then you must lose 10 pounds sweating. So it could be a good weight loss thing. Let me try, let me try. Hold on. Look out. Look out. Get out of my way. <laughs> End of the day, how'd you do? I was very impressed. Really? Yeah. I mean, we're not good. We're not ready to play. But I thought it was a pretty courageous punch. In total, 55 women turned out for the clinic. As for the likelihood that Lisa was named to the all-clinic team, well, we'll let you decide. 